Hello everybody, a short brief about reflexes today. The baby is born with a lot of surviving reflexes, like blinking, breathing. Some of the reflexes will stay with us all our life. Some of the reflexes will change into intentional movements like the opening and closing the hand. At the beginning it's reflexes but then when the child is the baby is growing up he see a toy he wants to open the hand grab it okay so some reflexes are changing into movements. I want to emphasize one specific reflex. It's a moral reflex. Moral reflex is the reflex that makes our child to, be, to look scared, okay, and to jump. It might be from a loud noise, it might be from something that he feels uncomfortable or you put him too fast into the water, it might be from anything. This reflex should leave the system around four months old, okay, by itself. If we see that it's not leaving the system, we need to encourage it. What, what do we have to do? We need to make this situation that will cause the baby to jump, like a feeling of falling, like sudden noise, like a um, sudden movement or sudden feeling on our skin. And when the baby is reacting, we are hugging him. Like we exposing the child to new experience, to maybe a little bit frightening experience and then we immediately hug them and give them the sense of security okay to feel that somebody is there to protect me i don't need anymore to fight or run okay so i don't need to be scared mommy and daddy are holding me i'm in a safe environment but I am exposed to a new experience, okay? So if you see that sounds are a little bit difficult for the child, make more sounds. Let him get used to sounds in a very safe environment, okay? Why it's so important for this reflex to leave the system? Because if there are rem even reminders of this reflex, two important reflexes are not going in or are not developing well in the system. And I'm talking about the protective reflex and the balancing reflex. The protective reflex is the reflex that if I feel like I'm out of balance, I put my hand to protect myself. I'm not falling like this my hand will protect me. Or if I'm falling forward, my hands immediately are going to protect me. Or even if you're holding the baby and you do like you are going, like, like they are going to fall down, they supposed, let's say, to catch your hair or to catch your uh, shirt and to try to hold themselves not to fall down. This is the protective reflex. The balancing reflex is the reflex that when I feel that I'm out of balance, if, some, if something shaked and I'm out of balance, I'm able to put myself back. If I feel that I'm, let's say, on the ball and the ball goes forward, I automatically trying to go back to balance myself, okay? It goes forward, back, and the two sides. So balancing reflex and protective reflex are very, very important 
for the babies, even in the early stages of learning how to sit and learning how to stand and walk. Okay, because if these reflexes are not developed well, the baby will try to avoid sitting, standing, walking. Okay, but again, in order to develop these reflexes, the moral reflex has to go out of the system. Okay, so just be sure that your child is going there around four or five months supposed to be away. I don't say that the child cannot be frightened suddenly from something, but look at his reaction. Okay, I got scared. What am I doing? Am I crying hysterically or am I just uncomfortable or even small crying? Like, uh, okay, check, observe your child and see if they need some help or they are doing it okay. See you next time.